Hello, Taurus, and welcome to Lady Blue. I'll go ahead and clear the space real quick for you here. Okay, Taurus, we're going to find out what your current energies are. If this is your first time here at my channel, thank you so much for clicking on my channel. For those of you who are subscribed to my channel, thank you so much for coming back. Okay, Taurus, we're just going to get right into it and find out what your challenge is today, okay? If there's anything that resonates in this reading with you, can you please give me a thumbs up? That's the only thing that moves my channel. I appreciate you being here, Taurus. Okay, so the challenge is, is that you are up researching at this time. Something that you're doing, introverted, okay? What is unseen? Looks like there's some luck coming in, okay? Reward. This could be at work or something, just just anything that's popping up in your life that can be luck. Luck can be anything. Focus. Okay, we have um, your focus is a, looks like it's about money right now. We have the homeless card. Okay, failure. Uh, cast away poor. Okay, maybe your focus is on trying to make sure that you have money for your future and getting things straight in your life for later on okay any advice okay uh third wheel okay so enemy distress uh flirtatiousness okay so we'll see what that is about okay there either could be a third wheel when it comes to advice or it might be something that we need to you know um really look into because of distrust on something Okay, or should we trust this luck that's coming in? Okay, but we're going to pull the tarot at this time, Taurus, to see what this is all about. Okay, let's get the challenge for our Taurus. Keep in mind, Taurus, I have already shuffled these cards before I started recording. Okay, let's see where we are. Okay, so the challenge is, is that something... Um, is moving in your life but it has slowed down a lot okay because this is in reverse but we shall see when it comes to something that you're researching okay um and when it comes to luck we have the king of pinnacles so this is about a practical energy okay you getting your money in order and being happy and comfortable in life okay at this time I'm um, really, really feeling the luxury in being practical and being down to earth, okay, when it comes to this king, okay? Something that, you know, is about external management, okay? So whatever you're doing in this material world for your future looks like you are, you know, you have this king here, okay? When it comes to um, you planning, ahead you have a reverse card okay so that's also telling me that you are really planning on what it is you want for later on okay um but you're not getting the information quick enough seems like okay um there's something from your past okay when it comes to this third will okay that you really um maybe focusing on or maybe something is changing when it comes to this third world or someone is coming back okay um from your past and you're thinking about it and it's all about memories at this time okay but let's keep going see where we are okay so it looks like you know you're planning ahead here you might have a couple of delays and things might not be you might have some energies that's blocked but you're definitely working on some things here yeah is a sense of you feeling like you know there's some blockages when it comes to what it is you want to do when it comes to your resources because you have the queen of pentacles here too so i'm seeing that it's all about you family life and you preparing for later Okay, you wondering about, you know, it's a nervous energy that you're probably having when it comes to what it is you want to do um, later on. Okay, when it comes to this Queen of Pentacles. But the Queen of Pentacles is all about also, you know, taking care of yourself. Okay, it's something that you need to do. You need to take care of yourself. And, you know, maybe this introvert energy is saying, you know, um, 
you're alone in a certain way, but you also are you really trying to find out some information from other people to build something for yourself. Okay, when it comes to luck, okay, in this middle row that you're not seeing, you got the King of Pentacles, which is a stable, practical, good energy. You also got luck here, and then you have the Page of Pentacles. Okay, and the Page of Pentacles is just like, okay, this is like writing a blank check. OK, whatever you're planting right now, you know, plant the seed because this page is here saying, OK, this is a new doorway for you. So something is unseen when it comes to, you know, your material world. OK, and then we have the nine of swords. So some type of worry. OK, when it comes to homeless, what you're preparing for in the planning part, you have these all these daggers above your head. OK, when it comes to where your focus should be, it's, it's about time that you let go of the the actual you know um anxiety in your life when it comes to this money issue okay and you know we have the king of swords okay in reverse so this is saying you're being very harsh on yourself in your mind at this time and you know um it's troubling you okay you, you're 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 not feeling the type of harmony you need and you're focusing you know probably a lot um when it comes to your past okay you are being very critical about it okay and um it's something that's really really something that you have to work on okay when it comes to this this team okay you 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 are really 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 judgmental at this time on what way to go okay in your life okay i'm seeing that you're trying and thinking about you know when it comes to introvert you're thinking about walking away from something okay and changing um direction for something better in your life okay but what this card is all about you know really you know you know finding what you really need to do and changing direction because you know there's something better out there for yourself so that's what you're working on okay but you're also so much in your in in this money issue is saying that you know you need to come out of that hermit mode and you know kind of like follow your light and take action now okay towards that luck that's coming in because when the page is here is all about you know um you know moving forward okay plant the seed yeah and the devil here is your sign in reverse so it's like you know um you're loosening up the grips on what is troubling you you're letting go of the ne negativity in your life okay um you know all those things or those addictions right now you're letting those things go okay releasing that that bond that that temptation that the devil has on you okay you're trying to follow your own light okay capricorn yeah and you have the empress saying that yeah you know fertility will come i mean taurus i'm so sorry um fertility will come so it, it's taking that for you to really realize that you need to do that okay that fertility will come this energy here taurus is all about um you being compassionate with yourself you nurturing yourself you getting back in nature because you are that grounded sign so that's what that is about okay you getting back on track okay taurus because you are definitely in your mind okay all right so taurus we are going to pull an animal card here see where you are taurus Okay, we have weave. Yeah, I'm seeing that with this spider. You know how a spider does everything to perfection? Okay, so I'm seeing you weaving what you need to weave when it comes to your future at this time. Okay, Taurus. And then we're going to get clarification here. Okay, on what it is. The final three cards for our lovely Taurus here. Okay. So I'm seeing that, yeah, you have two Knight of Wands here. So it's saying, move, get back out of this stagnant energy. Okay, whatever you're doing, Taurus, 
move move about what you need to move about okay to to get this prize this luck okay although you know you need to drop the load of exhaustion and stress okay because you're stressing yourself out and new cycles are changing so you have to change and go with the flow and you have the ace of pentacles wow so you got the page of pentacles and the ace of pentacles so it's definitely a new beginning okay for something um in your material world that you are looking towards and you are definitely trying to you know um manifest some of these things in your life when it comes to your future and you have good cards for that okay taurus so keep weaving what you are weaving and the the idea is to move forward to get out of this you know stagnant energy follow your light loosen the grip taurus on this anxiety follow your new path okay when it comes to new love when it comes to new adventure when it comes to being passionate about yourself you know and you know these memories that are coming up okay in your life do not worry about things that um is not in your present moment or that you cannot see at this time i would say to concentrate on yourself and follow that creativity in your life and don't be too judgmental on yourself at this time and keep planning for whatever it is you want for yourself but um things do look pretty good here so um Thank you so much, Taurus. If any of this has resonated with you, um, I appreciate if you give me a thumbs up. Take care, Taurus. Take care. Bye. Oh, Taurus, I forgot one more card. I'm so sorry. One more card for Taurus for manifestation. Okay, Taurus, I am so sorry. I'm off a little bit. Love has never, love was never absent from our lives. It is not bound in our hearts or in our relationships. And thus, this is not capable of being owned or lost. We have allowed our awareness of love to diminish. That is all. Okay. So that is your manifestation. So love was never absent from our lives. It is not bound in our hearts or in our relationships. And thus, it is not capable of being owned or lost. We have allowed our awareness of love to diminish. That is all. So maybe there's some type of with this third wheel, you are thinking too much in your mind about something or, you know, it could, you just really never know what it is, but you know what's going on in your life. But think about that, that manifestation card about love was never absent from our lives. Okay, Taurus, that is your final card. And I'm so sorry for mentioning Capricorn, um, but I'm only human, just like you. Thanks for being here. Take care. Bye.